everyone hope you're having a nice day so we're here to talk to you about our newest stitch school release the amazing Zara swimwear collection I say collection because she's got um, a bikini and mm -hmm. also a swimsuit um, and Rosie is the uh, the brains behind this and also the design really that was yeah, yeah your yeah. your your baby this has been so um, Rosie's gonna do more of the talking I will be like the uh, interviewer Oh so, yeah, I yeah, like that. Yeah. So Rosie, do tell me about the new Stitch School class. <laughs> well, the new Stitch School class, as Lisa said, is our newest, our first swimwear pattern that's yes. come out in the wild. Um, so it is the Zara swimsuit and bikini, and we teach you how to make these items, and we teach you all the skills about sewing with elastic, with the swimwear elastic, um, fitting, using the tricky fabrics, different threads, different needles, kind of all the tricks and tips to get the best out of your swimsuit or your bikini, but also how to make it enjoyable to do. And right, which is so important, because yeah. that's, you know, the process is also as, just as good as the result. That's it, yeah, yeah. I think that's what comes across strongly from it's taught by myself and by Layla who you will have seen on Stitch School as well um is to enjoy the process don't get too cross if something goes wrong because it's all fixable yeah but also I like, think it's us sort of not so secret goal in the class to make sure you feel super confident when you Aww, come out of it yeah. that you look and feel amazing and uh, that if you have a skip stitch that's not too bad. No. You've made a swimsuit. Exactly. So and also, one thing that I, because I made my um, version of it for mm. holiday, that I've really, really forgotten how easy zigzagging yeah. is to unpick. Yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> so much easier than a straight stitch but yeah no and it but also going back to what you thought I was mm. about to say is that it is easy and I think yeah. it's one of those things like underwear that we think is going to be really difficult because it's swimwear but actually if you've worked with knit before it's really not that yeah. much different and it's not a fiddly tiny little bits to it it's not like that no but, you know no. it's kind of like I'd say definitely that the the kind of bottoms of the bikini are easier than the top but the yes. top is not crazy difficult no you know, it's and, not no um yeah so yeah really good and again i i had myself down as um and maybe you shouldn't say this but i didn't feel comfortable wearing a bikini and i was like it's fine my bikini days are done i'm not going to wear a bikini anymore i love a one swim like a one piece but then i made this bikini and i literally i, I was so happy i just was like in my living room just yeah, like i'm not taking it off straight away i did <laughs> i text the uh, group the uh, team whatsapp group being like this is amazing i thought i couldn't wear a bikini anymore but i love this i feel really confident in it it fits me i've made it in exactly the fabric i want to because obviously we're you know we've got loads of choices with ready to wear nowadays mm. but less so with bikinis and swimwear and yeah things. definitely yeah definitely. and I really wanted it with my tummy tucked in you know nice and high and I could get that and so just yeah perfect yeah really perfect no I think we hope that the design kind of is like you were saying about the bottoms are nice and high-waisted so you yeah. get a lot of coverage there and across the chest as well it's you know you're showing off a little bit but not too much yeah we wanted a bit of that there yeah, we didn't want yeah. it to be and we've also discovered that well i had that if you tie your bow tighter you get a little you bit go, more cleavage <laughs> um so that's possible but you've also included an amazing nifty trick yes yes yeah so in the class obviously we talk through all the different ways you can personalize both the swimsuit and bikini we also include a way to put optional cups in so that's more for sort of coverage and shape but then we also show you how to draft another pattern piece that adds a sort of a, what we call a bust sling into um, either the bikini or the swimsuit and that just gives you a little bit more uplift and that's what I put in my samples okay. um, in the ones that I'm wearing as well and like Lisa okay. I've been done I've been swimming in mine since I made yeah. them no they work perfectly for either like lounging around yeah maybe you're not gonna swim maybe you're just gonna wear it on a beach which yeah. you know great or down the pool just doing lunch. Yeah, perfect. Yeah. And I love that it's the design goes across. So if you really are not a swimsuit person mm. or not a bikini person, but you love that design, well, it basically is the same in both. Um, so yeah, um, yeah, really, really like it. And very proud of us. Very proud yeah, of you. Yeah, no, just it's think been it's a labour of love. Labour of love. Good. Um, but also just so nice to have that in our collection. Mm. Um, so yeah, it's really feminine as well, which is so feminine and mm. classic. And I think it will really suit 
um, so many different people. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I already think like Alma and I are quite different shapes. Yeah. And we would probably wear quite different styles of swimwear. Yeah, but it looks fab on both. Yeah, of we you, both yeah. love it. Yeah, uh, and yeah, so brilliant. Um, so we did make an executive decision on this one not to buy in loads of swimwear fabric, which um, is weird because we always do usually have a sample fabric, but we don't normally stock that sort of thing. So we didn't want to have loads of fabric, especially mm -hmm. when there's so many people doing great, great fabrics. Yeah, yeah. So I've made a version, which we won't have photos of yet, but we'll pop that up on Instagram after my holiday next week. But there's some photo, there's some Liberty fabric that's swimwear fabric that's come mm. out. Um, and so nice. uh, Guthrie Ghani, I got mine from there. It was really, really nice. And it was expensive, but because I only needed a metre, I could afford to spend that £35 or mm. however much it was because, yeah. It was um, yeah, really lovely to work with as well. Yeah, the quality of the Liberty yeah. fabrics are just beautiful. Really lovely. Yeah. And yours was, where was yours from? Um, my, uh, the teal sample, the bikini sample that I made, uh, that fabric was from Sony Sunshine. Okay. And she tends to actually, all year round, have a little range of swimwear oh, fabrics. Amazing. Oh, so there we it go. It was really good. Yeah, really so good have quality. a look at some fabrics. So, where can you find the Zara? Well, if you are a premium subscriber, that means you're paying £15 a month, then you will have access to it already. So make sure you head to, just go to your account and it should be just there. And it's also on the new classes page as yeah. well. What's new on um, Stitch School. Um, if you're not a subscriber, you can sign up for £15 a month and it's a minimum of three months to sign up for and you will be able to watch and take the swimwear class as well as loads of other master classes yeah so what jeans b b pattern cutting yeah draft your own trousers so up a t-shirt to wear with them jackets and loads of patterns are included in the subscription like it's a really really good value for money and so you might decide after three months you've taken everything you want you know you've learned um, all you want or you might realize the wonder that is stitch school <laughs> and you'll continue there with us because we're always adding new things mm. to stitch school so if you are super confident at sewing and you're like, I don't think I'm going to need any extra help from Stitch School, but specifically for this class, I've never done any swimwear and I would, you can buy it as a one-off. It's just yes. £50 if you want to just buy it as a standalone class. Uh, but that's the only way you can get it. It's only on Stitch School. It's exclusive to Stitch School, so you can't just buy it as an individual mm. pattern. So just so that's super clear. So anything else I need to say about I don't think so. No, no, no. Thank you, no. So hopefully throughout this video, we will have peppered in some photos <laughs> magically and videos so that you'll be able to see what we're talking about. Um, and yeah, hopefully it's given you a taste of what the class is like. So don't forget to share yours when you make them. So we have got hashtags S O I Zara bikini. Mm -hmm. SOI Zara swimsuit. swimsuit. So keep an eye on uh, Instagram for those because they'll start to populate with all your lovely makes and you'll be starting to inspire each other. We can't wait to see your versions. Um, so yeah, that's it. We'll see you really soon. Um, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, help, subscribe. Bye.